Okay, so I've been trying to figure out how to do a dual PC stream. This is my gaming PC, this is my streaming PC. This PC is old, this used to be my gaming PC back in the day, but uh, I've since upgraded. Um, here's my mixer. I've got the, uh, the right here, the Yamaha MG10XU. Um, I've been watching this lovely gentleman here. Uh, I'll put his channel in the description, but, uh, Elena, um, that's his, I guess that's his in-game name, not his real name. Um, I've been watching this tutorial, and it's a good tutorial, but it's a little cut off there, so I asked him if he could make a, uh, another tutorial showing how, like, what I'm doing right now, showing all the inputs and everything. He wasn't able to do that, but he was able to, that's Gold Glove was able to make, the same day, another tutorial here, very in-depth, very helpful. Um, this video is kind of for him, just in case he ends up watching it. Um, so if you are watching this, sir, thank you for all your help so far. Um, the thing that I don't have is this right here. But I can show you what I do have set up. So, here's my Rode mic, goes into here. Usually I have the USB option, for the microphone going into here, but I've unplugged it um, just to, for the sake of this tutorial that you're showing so I can just get something to work. Um, it is going to this PC and this PC, so that's working so far. So these right here, like in the tutorial, these actually are from either, I think it's the green, maybe the pink, whatever the output is on the back of my uh, streaming PC goes into here. I am able to hear some audio, but only if I do certain things. So I'll try to show you here. So you can see down here, right there, that it's picking up my microphone. Um, if I do this little speaker test, you'll see every time I click, it actually goes all into the microphone level. I have figured out how to fix that by making this default and when I do that and I go here and I test this sound now they've separated. So they're separated in OBS and everything but my issue is I can't hear anything once I swap it to this. So if I swap it back to this, everything gets mixed into one line, but I can hear it on my mixer. But if I swap it to what it is now, everything is separated correctly in OBS, but then I can't hear it in my mixer. I also have this, so these ones here um, go out from my gaming PC, so like right here when he shows it in the tutorial, he's got this little mixer thing, I don't have that. So I did take it from the green port and plug it into there. Um, once I have unplugged this, because I use a USB um, headphone jack just to hear everything, once I unplug that and try to listen purely through the mixer, I can't hear anything still. Um, I've tried changing the um, the different things here, all my different lines. This is playback, so line one is usually what I have because I have virtual audio cables. Um, and then I got voice meter banana yesterday trying to figure stuff out. Um, but I can't hear anything from this through the mixer. I have to have my USB thing plugged in in order to do that. This one here, now I have, I went into here and I tried to figure out some different things with this, but the second this turns to 30, uh, it sounds like an alien invasion slash nuclear bomb is going off, and I don't ever want to do that again. Um, so I don't mess with any of this, but I was just trying to see if I could figure out how to, I don't know, duplicate this or something. I, I don't really know what all to do here. Um... This one obviously goes to my headphones, that works fine. Um, 
these two right here go into the blue port, which I believe is that right there because it's the Realtek high definition. Maybe I'm, I'm not entirely certain, but uh, nothing, no audio from here is getting pushed into this computer at all. My other thing I will say, I don't know if this has anything to do with it, but I'm just going to mention it. I do have an Elgato HD60 Pro in this computer here, but this computer is too old to where the motherboard doesn't even have a slot for it. So what I've had to do, I've tried taking the display from this computer and then putting that into the in of the HD60 Pro and then having it. Uh, HDMI go from out of that into this computer, but it still didn't work. I was able to actually get um, the picture and everything from this computer to this one, but it did not work from getting this one to that one, unfortunately, so I tried that. So, um, what I'm doing instead is I actually have another Elgato HD60 back there, so that's still 1080p and 60 frames, it's just an external one. So I have this HDMI going from my graphics card, which I have a GTX 1080, um, and then this goes into my streaming PC there, so it actually gets the footage there. So if I move this around here, I click on this, it switches over there. So it's getting the footage, but if I click like this, boom, you'll see there's a big delay. One other thing that I forgot to mention is that what I'm about to start talking about here uh, is when I did a stream last night. The way that I was able to actually capture the audio from my gaming PC to my streaming PC was I actually had the audio from the Elgato go through HDMI to my gaming PC. So I had the audio transferred over through HDMI, but this whole point of the mixer setup is to eliminate doing HDMI audio and do everything uh, analog and through the mixer and everything. So when I start talking about that my game audio was way farther behind than my video, that's how I did it through HDMI. I do not want to do that again. So I'm, I've been tinkering with trying to get the delay down because my microphone isn't delayed, it's just the Elgato and the sound. I tried a bunch of test streams last night. Um, I had to where I was able to sync my voice up with the game itself, the footage, um, but then the audio was probably about three to five seconds behind and I tried to put delays with the audio and everything and that wasn't working either. It seemed to function a little better once I closed out OBS and then opened it back up. It like refreshed it, but I don't want that to eventually fade out. So, anyway, that's something I'll just have to deal with unless one of you guys know how to fix that issue as well. Um, but yeah, so I don't have that little capture card thing. I don't know why it keeps doing that. Um, that he has here. I don't have that thing. Um, I'm looking at ordering it, but I can only find a kind of a more advanced one. Uh right there so um, yeah I don't know um, so I'm thinking about getting that if you watch this do you recommend me getting that do you recommend me getting an actual sound card like to put into the computer um, if so I don't really know how old this thing is if I'd have to put it in this one if you could even have a slot for it so that's a whole new issue I'm looking at getting a new PC but it's pricey and I don't have the money for it right now. This is like a seven-year-old PC with a GTX 660 and I've been using it up until about last year and so I finally was able to afford this upgrade here but this thing doesn't even perform the way I need it to either even though it's 16 gigs of RAM, uh, i7700 processor, uh, GTX 1080, stuff like that. It still runs very slow. Don't know why. It's aggravating. So, um... That's kind of my issue. I'll show you the dials so that you can see what all I have everything set to. So my microphone here, um, I have the gain set to there. Everything else is mid. The That doesn't really matter. Um, I have this turned up so that the little uh, splitting effect goes that way. Um, then my gain is, or my peak is there. 
um, nothing, nothing, nothing. Um, and then this guy here, go down. I have the effects turned up and this thing turned up. That's where I was able to start hearing things, but only through the this one right there, which isn't the right one. That's turned to there. This guy right there. And if you see this or you watch his tutorials, you'll know which, again, which ports go to where. So this is the gaming PC. This is the... Or I'm sorry, this is the streaming PC, this is the gaming PC, and, uh, yeah, so, that's there, this thing, I haven't really dialed with that, um, that's pushed down, like I said, I usually have the USB microphone going, um, but I switched it to, um, the auxiliary one, just for the sake of this tutorial, to try to make things work in general, um, this is turned to here, this is not compressed. This is turned that way. That's not on. So yeah. Um, hopefully that's, hopefully this helps, um, explain things and hopefully someone, uh, has a fix for this. So thanks for the, uh, help so far. And let me know if anyone knows how to fix my issues here. So to, to kind of recap what the issues are, I can only get audio on that one right there but then it doesn't capture it in here and it actually it does but it only puts it all into one line including my microphone i try to swap it to that then it does separate but then i can't hear it um i can't get sound from my gaming pc through the mixer to this computer and um yeah so if anyone has a fix i would greatly appreciate it um, again, I will leave the link to this gentleman here in the description with his tutorials. I'm sure that they'll be helpful to everyone else except for me, um, on account of I just literally have the worst luck with technology, even though it's kind of my job. So, that's my life. So, thanks for watching. Let me know if you guys know any fixes, and good luck with your setups. Thanks.